Hi, welcome back. In this video, we're going to learn how to use Adobe Stocks. All right, without further ado, let's get started. Uh, to give you an overview, Adobe has this uh, website uh, wherein you can go uh, get uh, Adobe Stocks or stock footage. If you want to go there, you can go to their website. Let's there you go. Now you have this Adobe Stock image work faster with Adobe Stock. All right. Computer software company with for Adobe. All right. So let's click on Adobe Stock images and you'll get this website. Adobe Stock. Find the perfect stocks assets for your next creative project. So this you can search. You can use this to search for any 3D premium editorial templates audio videos images or all all right so you can search for like a uh, photo here search and and uh, press enter and then you will see these all results for stack images for photo all right there you go so you can buy these um, stock footage or stock photos all right and uh, yeah, make sure you make sure you just need to sign in. All right, so to sign in here. All right, since I'm not signed, so there's a sell, there's a there's a button here to sell. There's a pricing and there's sign in. All right, and at the top there's a photos, illustration, vectors, videos, audio, templates, 3D, premium, and editorial. All right, now in the libraries. All right, you can just sign in here to. Uh, sign in here to uh, view your libraries. Okay. All right, if you can go back to Premiere Pro, you can search that. You can find those um, libraries that you downloaded using your um, Adobe Creative Cloud sign in. You can go to libraries here. All right, uh, libraries, click on libraries. And then there, since I'm not signed in, that's why there's no information yet. All right, but you can search here for all the information uh, of your libraries and also you can use it in the graphics so uh, if you go to essential graphics you will also see here the adobe stock all right so you can browse templates available from adobe stock and you can just simply drag and drop it directly to your timeline all right so that's how you use adobe stock all right in adobe stock if you go back here we can search for templates all right for uh, InDesign template photoshop uh, and uh, some free template in here. All right, you can just buy and then add it to your library and there right. you have it. All right, so basically that's how you use um, Adobe stock footage in, you know, uh, incorporated to your uh, Adobe Premiere Pro uh, to get some uh, footage, uh, to get some templates, footage, and so on and so forth. All right, well, thank you so much for watching and see you in the next video.